Statues here represent Aphrodite, the goddess of love. But how do they know that the statue itself represents Aphrodite? Like instead of other female gods or a female mortal? Have you ever think about it? It's all all the same. But yet like they share something similar such that it becomes Aphrodite. This statue looks so real. Look at his like facial features and his eyes. My camera just thought that this 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 guy is real. It's like a real face. But it's not a real face. It it was created I think in the in the first century. First century BC. Feedback form. You wanna write this? One more thing, I forgot. Legend, man, what a legend. This is how you do it.
we came here like around like 12, close to 1, and we ended right now 3.30. The museum takes you like 2 hours or even more than 2 hours if you read everything. But just now, those, those statues, those head statues that I show you guys, they are basically Roman emperors. And that bronze statue itself is Augustus, the first Roman emperor after the Republic has fallen and and they, they took over it as an emperor system. The guy is the first emperor ever. Julius Caesar was before him. He's so far the successor of Julius Caesar. What do you think of the exhibition? No comments. No comments. Okay. I find that it's something that uh, you shouldn't miss uh, because the museum has a lot, all the collection of the Greek history. It's something that everybody should come and have a look for. Mm. Agreed. A few moments later. Yo, so they have like this like mini garden area, as you can see within the museum itself. Uh, I think that tree, right? It's an orange tree. Check it out. Check it out, man. Lovely. Actually, to go to this place called what Anafiotica, this place with like a Santorini kind of a city vibe. But he sent us to Monastiraki, which is like a flea marketplace. Pretty messed up. Look at the ruins. As ruined as me. The flea market is all the way there. Yeah, that's the flea market. Closed off. Closed us at like 3 p.m. pretty early, but now we couldn't get inside. There's nothing much uh, technically, it's just like some columns and a building. The Acropolis is way better. Kitty! Idea what it is, it's just basically some ruins. Yeah, and yeah, it's closed. Right now, we're walking to the whitewash buildings. To be honest, I have no idea where we are. In fact, if you look up here, that's the Acropolis. So, we are somewhere in the middle. We have no idea where we are, but we are somewhere in the middle trying to find that elusive, elusive white buildings that. Oh, wow, look at this. but it was too just too dark to to take pictures or anything or video anything so probably gonna come back here tomorrow in the day right now we're just gonna have dinner and chill at the monastriki monastiriki square or something like a free marketplace 
go check it. So now we're gonna have dinner at this place called Ge Gecko To Ma Mori or something. I think I'm gonna screenshot it and give you guys the location. Or just gonna write it down in the subtitles. But very nice place. Check it out. Very quiet, very quaint. Apparently this restaurant is uh, recommended by the trip advisor. Hopefully doesn't let us down. Pretty nice place. Pretty quiet, pretty chill. Everybody's here, very nice. Try it out. Whoa, this is really really good. The texture is great, a bit salty, but it's really not bad. Very unique. Out of the three dishes here, I suggest the zucchini balls and the salad. Very not bad. The octopus a little bit too salty, but the zucchini balls. This is the picture. Yo yo guys, good news. We got desserts on the house. Check it out. I don't know what you call this, but this looks good. It's like a sweet, sweet dessert. This part here, there's this like little cave thing inside that goes inside. Apparently, it's like a, it's like a, it's like a prostitute area, or like the old times, a few hundred years ago. Two hours later. Yo, what's up, peeps? I have no idea where I left off. I cannot remember where I left off the video. Uh, we are in the hotel back again, and I'm just gonna oh shit! I'm just gonna end the video here right here right now hope you guys enjoyed today's episode by the way the museum is worth a visit especially if it's raining definitely can spend a few hours there for for sure man for sure two places we actually wanted to go today which is like philopapo hill like on a hill just beside the acropolis to check out the views there and the little neighborhood called Af afrotiki or I, I forgot the name man, the names are confusing to me but these two places in the evening but we, we were lost on the way, just circle around ages we had no idea where to go probably gonna visit these places tomorrow but tomorrow we're also gonna fly to Santorini so we'll see how that goes in the morning we have a lot of time but if it's afternoon we don't have that much time so I'll see you guys in the next video this is a lot of thought thanks for watching, love you guys I love Greece. Greece is my my country. My my place may come on Socrates, Plato, whatever. See you guys. Enough for me. Love you guys and goodbye. No, I ask you, I ask you what, what do you think of the exhibition? <laughs> what the hell is that cat doing there? <laughs> the hell is this cat doing, man? <laughs> <laughs> You want this? Hmm?